My name is Shovel Knight, and this is a little bit of behind the scenes of how I was made. Just kidding, it's me. <laughs> anyway, so, yes, this is my Shovel Knight armor. I'm sure you've seen it in the guitar covers video. If you haven't, link's in the description below. It is freaking badass now. I had to take the shoulders off for it, uh, because I had to redesign the whole thing. But, as you can see, I got some weathering on it. I actually put a little bit on the chest here, which is actually attached to my Velcro vest here underneath. Um, you can see that. You can also see it a little bit here. It's actually Velcro on top of my, my vest here that I used in Warhead. But it's not permanent. Obviously, I can use the vest again for other stuff. But there is some Velcro underneath this here and also on the other side right here. And the way I got these shoulder pieces on is actually a piece of Velcro looped over on top of this leather piece here. So that way I can be able to move my arms and these are free to move wherever they want to go. So that way I can do this, 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 and this, and this, this, and this, and this, and this. That's pretty freaking cool. Now I can show you the legs. I can kind of get down here. See, there's the crod side. I actually did put some weathering on there too. Uh, that's my ass. There's nothing on my ass. So there's. Uh, I also got a nice uh, gold design here. Nice cold, uh, cold, gold finish. Stop looking at my crotch. Anyway, so I'm trying to get to the legs. I'm trying to see. There we go. You can see the legs living. Now these do bend. There's actually a piece of Velcro here. I don't know if you can see it. That actually allows me to bend my knee. Yeah. And it's flexible. So I can bend it perfect 90 degrees without having to work the armor. Same uh, worn effect here on the arm, on the leg here. This is actually attached to this was an old uh, karate piece that I had hot glued onto this piece of uh, cardboard. Now all of this, yes, this is all cardboard. <laughs> this is all cardboard. Believe it or not, except for the horns. These are also Viking helmet that I had. And I can actually show you the Viking helmet real quick. This bitch, I just popped out the horns and I just stuck them in the helmet. Ow! Now, uh, according to, now, just to better look at the armor here, now I didn't put any weathering on the thighs here. You can probably see it's completely plain, but that's okay. Uh, but I did put some weathering on the crotch piece here in front. You can see I've got a little bit of gray, a little bit of uh, some green on there. Make it look a bit more ancient than it is. And also if you go down here, that looks pretty worn out. Like that, that he's looking, like he's seen some, uh, a lot of action, man. Same thing for the other side too. I just took a bit of black paint, just kind of went tss, 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 and just randomly sprayed it anywhere on the armor. Now let's go to the chest plate, which is up here. And yeah, another we uh, weathery effect effect weathery effect uh, I got a little over here I got it down here I got it up on the shoulders there's a big spatch of it up there I got more over here as well um, the back is needs to be fixed I can't spin this around at the moment because it's gonna fall off the thing there I wish I had like a, a proper you know thing to put this stuff on you know this whole armor I wish I had like a mannequin to stick it on but for now it's just gonna have to be hanging in the closet Ugh. But whatever, that's okay. And I got a little bit of a, a schmitz there on the uh, uh, forearm pieces, a little bit of schmitz there. Now, if you're curious of where, out of all this other stuff, where's the shovel? Wah, wah, wah. Yeah, I haven't even started the shovel. <laughs> I've been so focused on the armor that that's all that's left of the shovel. A freaking stick! Duh! And it's kind of annoying. I have to go like this to go to go through a doorway. So like I have to get through my doorway. So I have to get a like a bull nose or a bull kind of dodging at people. But this is probably the most badass costume I ever made compared to all the other stuff that I did. Like these are all the helmets. I got a whole, I got a whole bunch of stuff. This is probably the best functional piece of armor I've actually worn. I've made a Halo suit. I made an ODST suit. That thing collapsed on me. Well, it's like, I don't know, it just didn't work. But this, for sure, probably the coolest thing I've ever made. Hand, uh, what am I saying? Uh, free-handed, by the way, free-handed. All this is free-handed. 
with rep pictures and references and all that stuff that I found online from other cosplayers who made their costumes. So, uh, look forward to that skit. And, and I will see you in the next video. Bye-bye. Where's my Finnadagger?